Hi guys, so I'm doing um, kind of a different video today. Obviously I'm in a weird setting. I'm sitting on the ground in my roommate's room. She's back there. See? Say hi. <laughs> okay, so basically I kind of came up with a way to cut like graphic t-shirts um, or just t-shirt into a tank top. Uh, so this is good for spring basically because I did it because I realized I didn't really have any um, new or like cool tank tops that all the tanks up all the tank tops I have are all pretty plain or just like one color um, so I went through like all my shirts and found a couple of the ones that like I never wear or that um, I just like I'm kind of sick of or that are just old um, that would look cool as tank tops so this is one that I already did it was a v-neck at first and then this is how it turned out like a tank top you can see it has a cool design but um, it's just kind of like a fun new way to wear it for spring. So the next one is a little different that I'm going to show you. Um, all, all you need is your shirt and some scissors. That's really it. If you want to get technical, you can get like pins to pin it together, but you really don't have to. It, jagged edges, you can't really tell anyways. Um, so the one that I'm going to do is just a crew neck. So it looks like this. It has this pattern on it. Which is cool, but I don't really wear crew neck shirts ever. Um, obviously, except for like this when it's just like a t-shirt when it's like I have pajamas. Um, so I'm kind of winging it on this one, but it should still turn out cool. So the first step, take your t-shirt and fold it in half vertically like this. Um, just match up the shoulders. Make sure they're matched up. <laughs> okay. So, once you have it laid out in front of you, obviously readjust to make sure it's accurate because obviously you don't want it like uneven on the sides. Um, and then, take your scissors. And you can really decide a lot of this for yourself based on the kind of shirt that you want. But, base your, like, when, where you cut here is going to be how wide your straps are going to be. So, if you like wider straps, you can cut a little further. Um, it's really up to you, but I like kind of like medium size, I don't know, like two fingers. Um, so I'm just going to cut it right here, and then you just want to cut straight down, and then across. Um, the farther down you go, the more it's going to hang down on the side. Um, like this one, you can see the armholes are pretty big, so you'd want to wear like either a bandeau or like a cami underneath. Or if you're feeling adventurous, like a lace bra. Um, but this one, I don't know. You kind of just have to see how it turns out, honestly. There's not really much predicting here, but I'm just going to cut real quick. And it, if you can use fabric scissors, <laughs> that's probably way better. These are really crappy scissors, and they do not cut well. But it's not very easy to tell that it's badly cut. And it's easy just to go back in and fix up your lines, too, so... It's just easier with fabric scissors. So I'm going to cut straight down. And then you want to cut across like this, like for an armhole. Cut the whole entire sleeve off. Sleeves, I should say. So my sleeves are off. And now I have... It looks better if you just stretch out parts you cut it just looks a little more done but so this is the tank top I have now I could just leave it like this but I think I'm going to try to cut more of like um like a scoop neck or a v-neck I don't know
so I think I'm pretty much done. It's still a little uneven in the front, but that's something you can fix like when you try it on too. Um, it's pretty easy to just cut while it's on you. So this is my final product. Looks just like a tank top you could buy anywhere else, like Forever 21 or anywhere basically. Um, I might go in and like restitch these seams on the top just because they're a little loose because I cut off both sides. But um, yeah, I'll post a picture at the end of me wearing it because obviously I'm in my pajamas right now. But um, yeah, I hope you like this tutorial. Let me know if you want to see other ways to cut shirts. Um, there's a couple different ways I know. Like if you want to make a t-shirt into an off-shoulder shirt or I don't know, any ideas that you have. Um, if not, then that is it for me and I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>